Hi, this is Dr. Anil Kumar, Consultant Radiation Oncologist, Fortis Cancer Institute, Bangalore. Today I am going to talk about uh, introduction of radiation oncology. Uh, radiotherapy is the medical use of ionizing radiation to kill the cancer cells. At least 60 to 70 percent of uh, patients require radiotherapy as a part of multidisciplinary approach in their cancer treatment journey. Radiation is used in different perspectives. One is with a curative intent, the other one is palliative intent. With the curative intent, uh, either in a definitive mode or adjuvant mode, we try to give radiotherapy. That is post-surgery or as a definitive intent for casting of larynx or casting of cervix, we try to give radiotherapy. This radiation is planned either through externally, which is called as external radiotherapy or internally called as brachytherapy. The indications of radiotherapy are vast, right from benign indications like arterial venous malformations, trigeminal neuralgias and the malignant conditions, right from head to toe, we use radiotherapy at least in 60 to 70 percent of the patients. Radiation can be delivered through externally using a linear accelerator. This machine generates X-rays instantaneously whenever we require radiotherapy as well as through brachytherapy where radioisotope travels through the tubes and is inserted directly into the tumor containing cavity. The various techniques of delivering radiotherapy right from two dimensional the, the cobalt area what we started to three dimensional IMRT, uh, IGRT, rapid arc, SRS and SRT. The last ones are the most advanced way of delivering radiotherapy where precisely we can deliver radiation only to the target and sparing the surrounding normal structures. So brachytherapy is the other way of doing radiation where we insert the radioisotope directly into the tumor containing cavity. The side effects of radiation are uh, general side effects like fatigue, uh, weakness and nausea and vomiting and there are organ specific side effects based on the target involved like suppose head and neck cancers will get mucositis and skin reactions and pelvic radiotherapy will get side effects like increased frequency of urination as well as some rectal symptoms. At Fortis Cancer Institute, we have the best state-of-the-art radiation equipments which can precisely hit only the target wherever is needed and spare the surrounding normal structures. Thank you.